Okay, this is mental math, uh, how to solve for 4.3. So we have three questions in the show you know. The first question is, what is 350% of $10? Now for mental math, you have to know your basics. You have to know your 100%, 50%, 25%, 10%, 5%, etc. for mental math. For this one, you have to figure out which ones do I need. Well, I need to know 100% first, which I think everybody knows. 100% of $10 is that's so if 100 percent of ten dollars is ten dollars then 300 percent would be three times that which would be 30 dollars okay so right now we know 300 percent and the next thing we have to know is what is 50 percent if you go back to grade seven 50 percent is half of a number so what is 50 percent of ten dollars is five bucks all right so if i add 300% to 50%, I get 350%. 350% would be 30 plus 5, which is 35 dollars. So 350% is 35 dollars. Okay. Now the second one is what is a of 5 dollars. Well, again, we have to kind of know our basics. So we know that 10% for rule one, move the decimal one place. And for 1% last year, you learned to move the decimal twice. So this year, we're adding a new percentage, which is a tenth of a percent. And the rule basically is move the decimal three, three times. Let's look at that. Let's just look at 5,000. So 10%, if I think of the decimal being here, the 10%, I'm going to move the decimal one spot over. Oh, that doesn't work. Oh, hang on. We need to push the decimal move. All right, this is not going to work. I'm going to take a bigger decimal. Move that decimal one place over, it would be $500. If it was 1%, I would move it twice, so once, twice, and I would get $50. And if it was a tenth of a percent, I'm going to move it not once, twice, but three times, and I'm going to get five decimal zero 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 dollars, which is basically just five bucks. So what is one tenth of a percent of five thousand dollars? It is five bucks. And the last one, what is two and one tenth percent of twenty thousand dollars? Well, for this one, what we're going to do is, the first thing you really need to do is, if you have a percentage in your, um, a, a fraction in your percentage, you should always change that to a decimal version of it. So two and a tenth percent, these are the same number. Two and a tenth, two and a tenth. So for two and a tenth percent, you have to go back to the previous unit where you have to think of, or the previous question where we had a tenth of a percent. So I'm first going to think about what is one percent of 20,000. So one percent, we just said the rule was, Move your decimal two places, so once, twice. One percent would be two hundred dollars. So two percent, and for that, it's just double two hundred dollars. That would be four hundred dollars. So now we know two percent, and then we have to figure out what is this tenth of a percent, and that goes back to the last question. When you have a tenth of a percent, you take the decimal and move it three times, so once, twice, three times. A tenth of a percent is twenty dollars. So you add those two together, you get 210% is 